The Melrose District has some really cool retro places that you have to check out. One is called the Thunderbird Lounge. Let's check it out. Wow. Wow, Jeremiah, this is a pretty cool place. Thank you, thank you. Wow, the Thunderbird Lounge. I mean, you really stepped back in time here. Welcome. <laughs> we try. I love this. Okay, how did this concept come up about? So I grew up in Chicago, and everyone in Chicago had a basement. My grandmother had a basement. My parents had a basement. <laughs> and when we moved here to Arizona, I wanted to have that feel. So I, when I opened my own bar, I wanted it to feel like my grandmother's basement. Well, and it pretty much does. And what's really cool, too, is that you went and did some recycling of old bowling alley? Correct. So there was an abandoned bowling alley that was getting ready to close. And we went inside and we repurposed the bowling lane woods for our floors, the wood paneling walls for our walls, the office sign. Uh, as much as we could, we, we took from that bowling alley to repurpose and recycle. Wow. Well, I'll tell you, when you do stuff in, the first thing you hear, and that was the arcade games going yes. on. That yes. That is definitely a parent's uh, basement going on there. Yeah. How many do you have here, and what, what goes on with them? So we have 10 arcades. Uh, we also have 10 more in storage. We constantly rotate them out. I grew up playing arcades, as I'm sure you did. One of my first jobs when I was 16 was working at the arcade <laughs> in the mall. Uh, so I've always had a love for classic arcade games. All of the arcade games we have here are original from 1970 to the 80s, and they're all free to play. Oh, man, that's awesome. Okay, uh, but there is one thing that just caught my eye because I don't think I've seen these in a long, long time, and that's <laughs> a phone booth and a real phone? Yeah, correct, and it works. So. You need to call a cab to home, or you just need to call home, we got you. <laughs> Letting mom know where I'm at. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, this is great. Also, I love is the, the decor in here, which is really neat, because you do have that Midwestern feel on the walls and in the lamps. Correct. So we have all of the field stone, but with an Arizona flair to it. So all of the rocks are resourced from Arizona. It's all copper and turquoise field stone. So you have that Midwest feel, but it also has the connection here to Arizona. And all of our lamps were purchased here in the Melrose District, all authentic vintage 1970s lamps. Man, this is really cool. All right, the bar, that's really awesome too. And I'm noticing the back part of the bar, a very cool retro look and feel. Yes, yeah, so uh, my friend from high school actually custom built this for us using my old school colors. Speaking of the bar, let's go back and get some drinks. All right, let's make some drinks. All right. Jeremiah, we're behind the bar now, yes. and this is where the magic happens here exactly. at the Thunderbird Lounge, right? Yep. <laughs> well, all right, let's talk about a couple of drinks you have okay. here. What's this one right here? So this is our Farrah. Obviously, every boy growing up in the 70s, 80s had a poster fair on their wall. We yes. have one here. <laughs> it's a vodka, elderflower, and blackberry syrup. All right. And then the one next to it? Is the Hawaii Five O. Of course, you remember that oh TV my show? Oh, I, well, I wanted to go to Hawaii because of Hawaii Exactly. Me too. <laughs> uh, so this is rum, blue carousel, and cream to coconut. Ooh, I like that. Garnished, <laughs> garnished with some gummy sharks. <laughs> so cool. All right. Now you have the signature drink. That's yes. what I'm waiting for because I'm definitely a bourbon whiskey kind of guy. So this is your take on a... Manhattan and old fashioned. Like so it. this is called the Thunderbird and it's a bourbon, Montenegro and bitters. There you go. So Nick is going to make it here, one of the bartenders. So I'm going to have him as he starts to make it. He's pretty much just taking a little bit of, uh, of course, the uh, bourbon yep. and, and pouring it right in there. And this is the thing. This is uh, pretty much stirred, not shaken, right? Correct. That's the important part right there. And this is also served in our signature glass that you get to keep and take home with you. Really? Yes. Oh, my goodness, because it's awesome because it matches the decor here, so it makes you remember where you... Does anybody have a set of these yet? <laughs> oh, yeah. You, and you can buy the glasses on our website as well if you just want a set of glasses for home. <laughs> that is pretty cool there. So, all right. He's got all that into the, of course, the uh, mixer there. Stirring it around, which is really nice. And then the great thing is that your hours are pretty cool because yes. they start at what, four o'clock? So during the week, we open at four. On the weekends, we open at noon and we stay open till two every single day of the year. Nice. And, and what else do you have going on here besides just coming and playing the video games? So on Tuesdays, we have trivia. Wednesdays, we have karaoke. Thursdays, we do a Mexican bingo. 
and on Fridays and Saturdays, we have DJs and live bands. And then there's all types of events happening, so you always got to check the website, don't you? Yep, and they're always free. Everything we do is free to the public, and there's no cover charge. Oh, my gosh, that's really cool. I know the patio out there is amazing that yes, you have. Yes, beautiful patio. You got to check out. Oh, man, it's so amazing. All right, well, looks like this is done, so uh, by rule, I need to make sure it's, it's you know. It tastes all it right. It tastes all right, so. Ooh. What do you think? Oh, yeah, that's a Thunderbird right there. That's a Thunderbird. So I love it. Jeremiah, tell me where they can find more information about the Thunderbird Print Lounge. Thunderbird Lounge PHX uh, is our website, Instagram, Facebook. We're on all the social medias. There it is. I like it. I can go play some video games. <laughs>